can't wait to connect to full fiber speeds? Watch this video to help you set up your router in minutes. Before you get started, make sure you've received a text from us to let you know your service is live. Once you've got this, let's check inside the box we sent you. You'll find a UW Wi-Fi hub and its power supply, a white and yellow broadband cable, a grey broadband cable, and your wireless settings card. You may find a microfilter, but you won't need it. Next, you'll need to find your optical network terminal, also known as your ONT box. This small black or white box was installed by the engineer when they visited and will be found on a wall near a power socket in your home. Get your white and yellow broadband cable and plug one end into the red socket on the back of your router. Then plug the other end into the socket in your ONT box. If your ONT is OpenReach branded, insert it into the socket labeled Port 1 or LAN 1. If your ONT box is black, insert your white and yellow cable into the socket labeled Ethernet. Your ONT box should already be plugged into your mains. Just double check it's also switched on. Assemble the two-part power supply by sliding the plug into the slot on the power adapter. Then plug it into the back of your hub and then into your wall. Turn on your main plug and then turn on the power switch at the back of the hub. Your complete setup should now look like this. A sequence of lights will come on and may take up to five minutes to stabilize. You can now connect your wireless devices like mobile handsets and tablets to your Wi-Fi hub. From your wireless settings card, type the password into your device settings or scan the QR code to get connected. You should keep your router upright, off the floor and facing into the room with no obstacles or electrical appliances nearby. And that's it. You can now enjoy your UW full fiber broadband.